Hey, what up y'all? Mr. Cruz here, your friendly neighborhood producer back with another video. And in this video, we're going to be going over a brand new free plugin called Frontier. As you guys can see right here, Frontier is a brand new free plugin from uh, some people called D16 or Group D16 or something like that. Anyways, I'll leave a link in the description to where you guys can download this plugin for free. It is a limiter slash clipper, um, and I'm very interested in it because prior to jump into FL Studio when I was working at Reason, they didn't really have a really good dedicated soft clipper, and I use Fruity Soft Clipper on every single beat that I make. Um, I pretty much use it, throw it on my master chain just for loud. Loudness. Uh, so the fact that I have another free plugin that can do that, we're going to test it out and see how it matches up with how I normally do things in FL Studio. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to go over to my beat here, move this off to the side. Let's just pick a section that has the most going on. So it looks like this right here. All right, let's bring this back. So normally what I would do if I'm making a beat, uh, after I've mixed it and done everything that I want to do, I'll throw a couple of soft clippers on there with my meter plugin uh, and then just kind of start tweaking around until I get it nice and loud. So we're going to do that with this one and you guys are going to see me do this all in one step. However, first, I kind of want to go over some of the parameters that they're giving us here. Um, so they have the control input, which allows you to impact the left, right, or middle in isolation as well as all together. Now, I've never seen a limiter plugin or a clipper that does that, but I'd be interested to know and how somebody would apply that to their mixing. And they also have three different release options. According to the manual, it functions on a auto release. So fast would be a fast release and a slow attack. Slow would be the opposite, slow release and a fast attack. And then medium is kind of equal parts of both. And then of course you have like your options, your threshold, your output level and our reduction meter here. So the reduction, from what I understand, it uh, works as an auto reduction. So no matter what, um, it should keep things below zero DB so that no matter what's going on, you should not be clipping. Uh, and then up here, we have a couple of interesting things. So we have the initialize and preview, reload next, save and browse. Now, as far as I understand, if you just click it, that will impact whatever parameters at the bottom. But if you hold control, and then click it, so this should initialize. So I'm gonna move some stuff around here, and then if I click Control and press this button, initialize should take place, which it does. So that's kind of how those works. Uh, and then the browser for the different presets, so it comes with a few, um, a few factory presets, but they also have different categories that I, and I guess you can kind of create and add your own categories to this. Uh, which will be great, but I'm not really that interested. I, I, I kind of know what I want to do. Um, once I'm in here, so I'm not worried about that. Uh, and then you have your soft clipper that you can kind of turn on and off with your output meter and your output level. So we're gonna leave our output level just short of zero dB. Uh, let's turn this all the way up and I wanna affect left and right and I do want a fast release with a slow attack. All right, so let's go ahead and start listening and then kind of see how this works. My dumb behind don't even have it turned on. so I do think it gets it nice and loud uh, I'm not sure that I like it uh, just because it, it sounds like there's a whole lot of pumping going on uh, and I just don't kind of get that 
effect or those results when I'm using the Fruity Soft Clipper. Um, but let's kind of compare to see how how much louder, because that's essentially what I'm gonna be using a Soft Clipper for, is just to boost the loudness of my beat. So I'm gonna turn on the clippers that I had previously, and then I'm gonna turn this one on. You'll notice that I've got two Soft Clippers on there. That's just because I like to have one that's just like slightly clipping, and then the other one that's really like doing most of the work. So uh, we'll turn those two on and then we'll A-B it with what we have with Frontier. So, um, interestingly enough, right, the Frontier limiter does absolutely cut everything off at zero dB, which the Fruity Clipper doesn't necessarily. I mean, it, it kind of does, but it's just a little complicated to understand um, how it does, but it doesn't. But the one thing that I just don't like about Frontier compared to like what I normally do is um, I don't like that I really am getting much more of a compressor effect than I am like just a straight up clipper because that's really all I want is I don't necessarily need a, a, a limiter. What I want is a clipper that I use very often. Uh, and I understand that a limiter is a clipper set to like infinity threshold but um overall uh i i'm interested to kind of like keep trying it out and see what i get with it um i wasn't good at using a clipper until i started using a clipper so maybe i'm not that great at uh using a limiter yet but there you guys go uh, a free limiter i mean you kind of can't go wrong with just getting it straight up for free from d16 group i would at least download it and try it and see what you like with it um i do think it's interesting that it has these controls to be able to control left right and mid but maybe you guys will have uh, better luck with it than I do. And of course, whenever you're done mixing and mastering those beats, those slapping beats that you're making, head on over to BeatStar, sign up for an account and start uploading them so you can turn your passion into a profit. If you're interested in joining me over on BeatStars, make sure to click the link in the description below to sign up. And if you use my code CRU230, I'm gonna hook you up with your first month of BeatStars completely for free. And if you're not subscribed already, do me a favor and hit the subscribe. Let me know what you guys think about this plugin in the comments below. That's what I got for you guys. It's your boy, Mr. Cruz. Out.